What is holding you captive? Fear, panic attacks, depression, anxiety, loneliness. That is not who you are. Amen. And that is not your reality. There is good news for you. Jesus has purchased the freedom for you. It is yours now. Jesus came to set us free from everything that holds us captive. Everything, not just one thing. Everything, maybe poverty, maybe physical illness, maybe you're just going through some relationship problem, maybe you're just dealing with some mental health issues. It's not just talking about one. It's talking about everything. So whatever you are going through, and everything that you are going through, Jesus has come to set you free from that which holds you captive. Your main enemy, your real enemy is not your circumstances. It's not your depression right now. It's not your, the things that you're struggling with. Your main enemy, your real enemy is what you think about your circumstances. What you think about your circumstances. Your beliefs. All right. See, our emotional transformation of freedom actually comes from renewing our mind. And how do we renew our mind? Is through the Word of God. We have to use the Word, the Sword of the Spirit, the Word of God, the Sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God to kill the giants that is in your way. You need the Word of God, the Sword of the Spirit. You cannot live without the Word of God. Your, your belief systems can be changed through the Word of God. Amen. 